I'm a seismologist and my main research interest is to understand the processes controlling the dynamic behaviour of the interior of the Earth from the surface all the way to the bottom of the mantle at about 3000 kilometres beneath our feet. I study the source process of global earthquakes and at the same time I also build 3D images of the Earth's interior. Importantly, I investigate the links and controls between earthquakes and 3D Earth structure. For example, flowing the Earth's mantle uh, shapes partly the Earth's surface, controls earthquakes, volcanoes and also uh, the formation of mountains. However, there are many things that we still do not understand. So, for example, we do not understand if variations of structure in the mantle are due to temperature or chemical composition. We really do not know either what are the trajectories of mantle flow. Uh, likewise, uh, we do not know in detail what happens during the earthquakes. Now, in order to address these really exciting questions, I developed new techniques to build images of earthquakes and of 3D Earth structure. One of the techniques uh, that I have developed is called seismic tomography, which is similar to CAT scanning in medicine, whereby we use seismic data that is uh, recorded at the surface of the Earth, uh, and we use as well computational algorithms to create uh, detailed images of the inside of the Earth. I develop the theory, I develop uh, computational algorithms to, uh, that are needed to build these detailed images of the Earth's interior. Now, since the 80s, there exists a global network of seismometers all over the world uh, from which uh, we get data, continuous data, uh, that are recorded every day uh, and that we can freely download uh, from the internet uh, today. Uh, I use huge volumes of data consisting of over a million um, seismic measurements uh, that we can then use uh, to build these detailed uh, images of the Earth's interior. My work um, has in particular shown some very clear links between shallow and deep uh, Earth structure. Uh, there is a wide range of crucial information uh, in such seismic data, which I fully explore, uh, but also recently with the expansion of satellites, we can also use such satellite data, uh, including radar data, to study earthquake source processes. Uh, and in our recent work, we have in particular shown that such radar satellite data provide complementary uh, information about earthquake source processes compared to seismic data. The ultimate goal of my research is to continue investigating deep earth uh, processes, earthquake source processes and their links, and to integrate uh, their, uh, this information with other disciplines such as geodynamics, mm -hmm. rock mechanics, mineral physics, tectonics, to understand the large-scale behaviour of our planet over geological time, the nature of earthquake faulting and the associated hazards.